Howdy, 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 y'all. Welcome back. Welcome to Fort Destiny, where if you want to know the games where your money belongs, come check it out with Army Mom Strong. Check it out Osiris New Dawn today. We got this game a while back, but then it was removed from Steam. I don't remember if I covered it. I know I played like four hours of it. I should have looked. It came out January 18th, 2023. It just got re-released to Steam. $34.99 USD, single or multiplayer. Just has a couple of really big updates also. And Steam says, Osiris New Dawn is an unforgiving near-future space survival game with a cinematic feel and elements of horror. Play as a mission specialist in a single or multiplayer to build your planetary base, pilotable vehicles, and controllable drones as you explore a dangerous solar system far from Earth. So I enjoyed it last time. It was just pretty buggy. Um, so I decided to wait until it was a little bit better. We're going to do story campaign, which is recommended, but you also have creative mode and challenge. So this, I mean, uh, we'll do new character so I can show you all of it. So you got scientist, which is going to give us 18 science, seven engineering, five combat. So it shows you your speed, health, strength, and stamina. Now all these things can be leveled up as we progress. We have ranger. We have Marine, and we have Engineer. I think I do want to go with the Engineer. He's got good health, good strength, and good stamina. Combat's not great, but again, we can level that up. So let's pick Engineer. Our primary color is going to be Teal. Our secondary, of course, is going to be Lavenderish. Uh, let's do that too, and I don't really see the glow. Okay, and we are AMS. Looks good. Let's do it. We have normal mode, the way the game is meant to be played. And then we have easy. It's a lighter Osiris. We might switch if this is too hard. We might switch over to easy because normal, when I played the last time, was hardcore. But, you know, we're going to try and play the normal. I'll let y'all know or let y'all decide if we need to switch over to easy. Let's go next and launch. Like I said, I really did enjoy it. 20.22 light years from Earth. Let's see if we can get through one episode. In 2046, Osiris mission pros were sent to scout the system. Shortly after arrival, odd contact was lost. The UNE Phoenix arrived 3.6 years ago to establish permanent human settlement. I gotta do some audio adjustments. It's loud. After 60 years of interstellar travel, the UNE New Dawn arrives to resupply and join the Phoenix crew. Oh, what is the puppy getting into now? It's been so long since we had a puppy, we forgot how much work they are. And bad things happen. Our escape pod. Pretty sure we were driving that. Ooh. All that debris. Coming in hot. Can you imagine how horrifying that would be? Cyrus New Dawn, loading persistent nature. Yeah, we might need to adjust some audio settings. That was pretty loud. Okay, let me. Oh, there it goes. Let me load it in and I'll bring it back, but it went. And here is where we landed. Patch your suit immediately. Okay, so fun fact, I just did all this, but then I realized that I was doing a first 100 days recording last night, so I had all this stuff muted. Your health vitals are low. So now we gotta Find do it again. Wounds. I'm trying a new series. We're gonna do a first 100 days. 
not in this game, in um, Farm Together 2. Okay, so we got that done, got that done. Let's get out of here. Atmospheric conditions. Oxygen 0.4%. Pressure is 2.5%. Okay, top left we have our tutorial. Or Shelters our mission. Shelters built for protection from dust storms. Alright, now we gotta get all these gobbins. Barrel. Bandage. Pump. Oh, we're gonna need these rocks for our defenses. Another oxygen tank. I don't feel like there was this many rocks here when I just recorded all this. Maybe there was. Maybe I just don't remember. But yeah, I had a lot of fun playing this last time. Like I said, it was very enjoyable. It was just pretty buggy, but it's now back on Steam. So I am happy they got that worked out, updated it, and they didn't just give up like some people do when their game doesn't launch well or doesn't... It's a lot of criticism. Hey, as long as you're working towards fixing it, I am all about being there for the long haul. Uh, oh, we got this piece too. Anything else? One, one little piece there. Oh, oh yeah, I almost got it. There we go. Okay, anything else underground that we almost missed? Yes, right here. I just saw a left mouse button to dismantle. Yeah, sometimes you can't see it. So you kind of got to peruse. Make sure you're not missing any goodies. And, okay, I think that's it. Okay, let's go over to our pod. You want to stay with the tutorial. If you get ahead of it, you have to redo things, so you might as well just do what it's asking. Okay, let's hit B to change camera view. There is third person and first person. Not a fan of third person in this game. It makes me a little nauseous, so we are going to be playing in first person. I don't know why. Some, some games... I can do third person, some games I can't. Gives me a headache, makes me like super sick to my stomach. Oh, we need to use the oxygen in the pod. Oh, and we need to dismantle this too. So let's get that taken apart. Okay, there's one oxygen there. Plant like life forms detected. Extract plant material. System computer, report on the new dawn and crew. The New Dawn suffered a reactor overload during interstellar breaking, causing the catastrophic system breach. No living crew members detected. Okay, I don't see anything else. But I mean, I am living. I, I'm here. I just don't think they know we're here. Okay, there's a crab shedding there. Okay, so we need to build a scrap hut. So under tab and... Oh, that's inventory. Tab and then build structure. Scrap hut is going to be seven... Scrap debris and two... Oh, I didn't want that. Um, two makeshift cloth. Oh, I didn't go get plant fiber yet. I'm like, why don't I see cloth? Yeah, well, because I gotta go get plant fiber. Or alien fibers, I think it's called in this game. So we'll grab that one. I'm not gonna pick up the crowd shedding because it's gonna make us pick it up again. So we're gonna have to run around to look for it if we pick it up now. What else do we have? Grab that, grab that. Carbon based rocks can be used in emergency situations. Okay, I think that is. Oh, wait, no, let's grab some berries too. Ten harvest remaining. Gotta get food. We have to have water, and oxygen and temperature are the main things we gotta watch for in this game than the alien creatures. Let's just get this to where we got berries to snack on. I think this is like the fifth time I've tried recording this, so hopefully everything goes good this time. I was either losing power the other day, it was like three days ago and I tried to record this, or I just wasn't tracking because it was so busy at work that I couldn't do the two. I couldn't jump between the two different things. Um, okay, so we need to build a scrap hut and craft a shard blade. So let's go right here under build. Uh, we need three cloths, so one. And the bones are going I will be right back. And we are back for how long? Who knows? Okay, so how many cloths did we make? We made three. I couldn't remember. 
uh, as a lot of you know, working while working, so I will have to put in cuts to take company calls. So, the, the perk of owning a business with hubby. But he's out in this humidity doing the field work, so I will happily stay in the confines of my home. Let's uh, F and F again. Let's go ahead and hit Mine F to set our noise. respawn and get some health back. We can make a shard blade, so let's go build. It wants us to make... Construct a workbench for tool creation and repair. You can also dismantle items into smaller components. Okay, so two cloth and one stone blade. We'll make a shard blade. Got that done, so let's go to our inventory and pull that down into there. And now we need to make a workbench, so build. It's going to take one cloth and four debris. Let's make another cloth. And workbench can go right over here. Oh, let's kind of tuck it in so that they can't get through or get in between. Okay, Alien so we need to detected. get three Collect samples. Your creature. workbench can recycle creature parts into hide for crafting leather. Creature sheddings, they're always going to be here. At least they have every time I have restarted this and attempts to get this recording done. But I am determined, because I really want to see if this game will do well on the channel. Most survival games do really well for me, and we need a new game to do good. So we need to craft a barrel, top left. So let's go into F, and barrel. Okay, take all, and we need to build a, a furnace. furnace. can be used to create metal objects. Oxygen is a natural byproduct. Remember to add fuel to your furnace. Okay, we need to go to B to recycle objects, and it told us to put alien hide in, or alien parts to get hide to make leather. Uh, we'll put that into. That will give us some food. Does our crab antenna give us anything? No. As just checking, we also are going to need more fuel, so let's go uh, B. Oh no, we need to make. What do we need? Okay, still thinking about the workbench. Uh, build. Utilities. We need one crude pipe. Okay. Let's go here. To make a crude pipe, we just need two scrap debris. Let's take that. Let's go here. Build. Utilities. Furnace. This can be... I think everything can be upgraded in this game. It's pretty neat. Um, I'll tuck you in right... There. Okay, it wants us to a add... radar can be used to find resources in a wider radius. Fuel. And then we have uh, oxygen somewhere on this. I think it's back here. Yeah. Okay, so we can use... And if we want to upgrade this, we can get a precipitation collector upgrade, so we'll have water. We have water distillery upgrade, fuel cell upgrade, and low heat upgrades. On this one, our upgrades are a repair bench upgrade. So we need aluminum, lead, and leather. So we need to craft leather from that alien hide. We're just going to craft it all into leather. And we need to make a makeshift chisel, it says. So for that, I need aluminum and crude pipe. Let's go ahead and put the radar dish up. What do we need for that? Build, utilities, circuit board, and a wire. We can make wire with broken wire. Circuit board with broken circuit board and a regular wire. So now we need another wire. Take all. Okay, B. No, not, not B. Tab. Utilities. Radar dish. We're going to put it over here. Craft that. Okay. Are you there? Come in, Mark. Do you read me? Dawkins! You're alive! How did you survive the... We're stuck here in the nav module. Power systems are low and life support systems are damaged. You need to find Phoenix team to help. There's not much time. What about Zhang and Hawks? How are you on supplies? Zhang and Hawks didn't make it. I was lucky enough to be in the nav module when the explosion happened. But Hawks was helping Zhang in engineering. Roger that, Dawkins. Glad you're okay. This channel is using too much power. I must conserve. 
Please hurry. Uh, as you can see, the tools go really quickly when you're getting stuff that's too hard for it. But we repair them for free and we will get better tools later. So let's go repair and pop that in. Get that repaired. Okay, so now we can go F, make shift chisel. We're actually going to make two of these because they're going to break pretty quickly. And we got some points for that, so we'll put them in four and five. We now need to locate our buggy, which is south, southwest. Um, do I want to... That's probably going to be way too hard, isn't it? Does this one do any better? It actually does do a lot better than that. Okay, so let's grab up what we can because we're going to need supplies. And then we can go look for the buggy. We're going to need to get a bunch of different things to repair it. Get one more before it breaks. Nope. Okay, we'll just finish it off with this one. As the hardness increases, it, sometimes your tools won't do anything at all. Okay, so we need to G to repair. Let's pop you in. And then let's get you repaired up. Still got a good amount of inventory space, so let's go get our buggy found. Probably wouldn't hurt to get some more fibers if we see them, too. So I remember we need cloth for a lot of different things. Can't go that way. There is a jetpack we have at the start, but I generally hurt myself on it, so... Buggy is right here. Okay, so we need to salvage the wrecked stuff so we can get some supplies to make better stuff. To get it working. Salvage that. 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 Anything else? Yes. Okay. Uh, begin repairs. So we want to B to add the build goal. Add a build goal, add a build goal, add a build goal. Alright, that should all be added to our, what we need. So we can go back to the house. Oh, northeast. Southwest and northeast. And get that stuff crafted up. Um, I think we are going to need more ore, so let's go see what we have down here. Some more aluminum. Thought about doing 100 days in this game, but it's going to take me a while to get all that clipped together. I really want to get some of this content going up for Osiris, because like I said, it's a good game. What else do we have? That's that lawn. So that, yeah, it's hardness 8. No way. Oh, we did grab some iron already. I just need a little bit of all the things. Oh, that's lawns a day, or that's lawns. Lawns and lawns. Let's grab some copper. I want to say we needed tin, too, if I remember right, but I might not. We'll upgrade these chisels, too. And it won't take us hardly any time once we get upgrades going to go out and get supplies. Oh, we got some more rocks. Rock, rock. These are going to be important to grab anytime we see them. Because things are going to come to attack. And we want to make sure that we are covered. Grab some copper. I think that it's worth grabbing while you're out. Especially a few pieces here and there. Because we're going to need it all. We need to make a chesticle too. Kind of limited on scrap debris at the current time. Okay, so we need five rubber, four bronze, a barrel, a hose, and a fuel cell. So craft. I don't see rubber in there, but hose we need. Rubber and a broken hose. Is rubber in here? 
it is. Uh, two, three, four, five, six. And you can do hose from that. Okay. Oh, we can also do some alien food from that one thing we got. That alien tissue we got earlier. Okay, and we needed one hose. We need four bronze. So we gotta go find ten and magnesium. And we need a fuel cell. Oh, we need one more rubber. And can we make a fuel cell? Plastic, three crude batteries, and a wire. We can do the wire. We can probably do the plastic. Plastic? Oh, I don't want to do... Is wire cheaper in here? Yeah, I want wire from broken wire. Go ahead and turn both those into regular wire. And then we need two more crude batteries batteries just hydrocarbon solution I don't even know how to get that yet but we might find some throughout the world uh, we still are good on space also it is dark 30 I hear critters All right, let's see can we oh, there's our light let's build a couple rock walls go right there and we leave we can take these with us so I think you get everything back or at least you used to Enjoy oh come on day. hold on I'm just trying to place this uh, get out of that where are you I don't need a big spot I just need a little there you are where'd you go so I can harvest you we need your gobbins Alien hide. Oh, that'd be good for leather later. Oh, this is respawned. Okay, let's see if we can't sleep through the night. Go ahead and scoop more of this up. I guess I really need all these things. And we had, needed to find, what, tin? And I needed to add that to the... Oh, hello. Uh, switch. Add what we need for tin for bronze bars to the list. Our build list. Okay, so we needed uh, right click, add the build goal. So tin and magnesium. Okay, can we sleep through the night? Sleep. Yes. Maybe we can get it a little bit brighter out. We definitely want to get our buggy repaired so that we can be using that to get around a whole lot easier sometimes sometimes me walking is much easier than trying to uh drive anywhere okay let's go ahead and activate stabilized. our oxygen is still pretty good wasn't there another place we could go check out that might have stuff we need over here yeah right over there let's see that's iron right yeah iron Iron. What else is over here? Some crab sheddings. Some fibers. I'll take that. Like I said, we're going to be using cloth all the time, so. There were some more berries there, but I don't think we need those right now. We still have all the, the pocket pool that we got earlier. That's just stone. With a crab shutting and a crab antenna. What is this? Gold. Might as well grab it. Better to have and not need and all. We got a good amount of space in our pockets and we're not far from home. Let's go ahead and turn our light off since it's daytime now. And it's not a very tough metal. What can we get from here? Anything? Dismantle that. Dismantle that. Put a piece there. 
Some more iron. I don't see anything else here. Uh, there's some more copper. We're good on copper right this second. I need tin and magnesium. That's what we're looking for at the current time. Iron. Iron. And lawns, right? So can we... Where's our map? Wait, where is our map? Uh, field guide options, missions. Field guide? Oh. That's a lot. Temporary base. And I'll grab that. And we are back again. For how long? We never know. That's back where we came from. There's a way. How do you look at the map? I don't remember. It's not M. Let's see. Field guide, skills. Oh, there's tons of skills in this game. We do have some points. We get two stat points. Let's do speed and stamina. Um, I got points in all this to increase solar panel output. Allows the separation of alloys into their base elements in the forge. Ooh, that sounds really good. Uh, you apply your experience in engineering to better recycle low-tech items, increasing the amount of uh, 15 engineering points. We have 33, so let's get that. That's 15 science points. We have 29. Let's get that. Not worried about water. Uh, salvaging speed, I'm not worried about either, but we gotta let's see. We got some combat points, so melee weapon damage plus ten percent. Mania tool damage. Ooh. Let's do that. Let's see, we still got eleven combat points. These are science. Boost nutrition. Uh four science points. We got fourteen. I think we have to get this before we can do that. Increase spacewalk speed. We'll grab that. Increase nutrition. Plant growth speed. That could be good. Uh, medicine potency. Oh, it's six points. We only have four. Okay. We have more in engine. Can I bring this out some? Yes. Okay. So this is engineering. Increase your hover boot. Uh, so we'll do faster salvaging so that we can open up this. Crafting speed. Structure health speed. Repair. Salvaging speed. Three points left. Nothing's going to cost that. So, And we still have 11 points in combat. Mining tool damage. We'll do that. And that's probably it. Okay, so we have inventory, crafting, GPS. Uh, Man-made, low hardness, medium hardness. I need... And we're scanning, but I don't see any in our scan zone. Oh, there's some right down there. Where are we? What, Rowdy? Is that us or is that our satellite? So, just south of the cell. Well, it's both of us right now. Okay. So, let's go this way and see if we can't get that tin. Maybe it'll have magnesium with it. Oh, man. We definitely move faster now. Nice. We'll even be able to put a satellite on our buggy. So we'll have, like, moving... Crab shedding. So I'll always grab that. Oh, that looks tinny. Mercury. But it's only 1.5. So I'm going to go ahead and grab it. Oh, that is a very pretty... Metal. It's almost our channel colors. Anything else? It was just south. And it wasn't very far. Oh wait, I can see it on the mini-map. What do we got up here? We got something. Okay, maybe that's it. Tin! Yay, we found it. We did it! Episode 1, I want to get our buggy up and running. Okay, what else do we have up here? More mercury. And if needed, we'll just throw a repair bench down and then pick it back up. Get our stuff back and head home. So we still need magnesium. Here's some more aluminum. So we're going to need a whole bunch of everything, so I'm grabbing what we can, when we can. Oh, 
Let's go two. Some more fibers. Pretty sure I like to run into those. Okay, that's gonna do good for more leather. Leather and the leather. And what do we have? Cobalt. Oh, let's see if I do it with this. No. We'll need it later, but I don't want to break all the tools on it when we are really looking for magnesium. Um, let's go tab. Where's that GPS? Skills. GPS. We want magnesium. Looks like there is some northeast of our base. So we'll head back that way. We're gonna have to redo our oxygen pretty soon too. It's not doing too bad. Why can't I move? Why am I moving so slowly? I think it's the last thing we need, then we can get our buggy repaired. Oh wait, so there's some magnesium right here. On the mini map on the top right, little purple dot. A magnesium. Look at us being aware of our surroundings. Put that in the record book. Looks like there's more right over there, but let's get home and get to see if we can't get all this made. Yeah, because we are not far. And I want to get us some wheels. So we need what? Oh, we might need more tin and magnesium. I don't know if that's enough to make four bronze bars. Or three more bronze bars. We'll find out in a moment. At least we know how to find it. Need a lot more rocks. I probably need to make this area a lot smaller. Okay, use... Uh, one, two, three... And then we all have take that. So we need a barrel. That's a broken barrel. Oh no, this this way. Barrel. And we need a fuel cell, so we just oh, we need those crude batteries. So I gotta find hydrocarbon solution. I wonder if I hold on. Inventory. Do I need to put like an empty barrel here? Go up to one of these gases or the water maybe right here? Let's see, what is this? That's oxygen. What is down here? I'm assuming it's all right here at spawn. It's going to all be close by. That's a oh, hydrocarbon solution. Extract methane. Requires liquid quadrainer to extract. Okay, so we need to make one of those. <clears throat> oh, let's see. A barrel. Okay, so barrel's not right. Oh, maybe one of those glass containers, I bet. Uh, which I can't make in here. Do we have one? We have one, but it's full of water. Stores liquid so that it can be drank or used use most more useful later. So do I need that in my hand maybe? Only one way to find out. Extract. There we go. Look at us figuring things out. Okay, so now we need two more crude batteries. Was it here? Yes, one. Two. Take all. And then the buggy was what? Southwest, I think. I think it was right over here. Pretty sure. Yeah, it's right there. I'm trying to get this done before my husband pulls into the driveway because he is home now. He's up at mom's. Okay, so build, build, build. 
Oh, I forgot to turn it into a fuel cell. Darn nabbit. Come on. I guess I could have just popped a workbench down over there, huh? Mistakes were made. Oh, more rocks, though. Happy day for us. Okay, we need fuel cell. Take. Thought there was something trying to kill us over there. Back to the buggy. Was what right over, right over here. Come on, I don't have much time. Let's go, move, move, move. I'm running out of time. Build that, build that, and that. Oh, I don't know if that's done. Hey, we got our buggy. Okay, so we can refuel Takashi logs. I don't know what that is open inventory so we have a little bit of inventory in our buggy we can upgrade so active scanner upgrade is going to be scrap debris circuit board and a wire a fuel reactor upgrade is a hose some makeshift lashings and some debris tank hauler oh this is all very doable so all you need to do is go home and make a circuit board which we got the stuff on us for uh, but we need to fuel it uh, how do i fuel it Or maybe I can't because I don't have. Rowdy, stop! Uh, let's see, a fuel reactor. Makeshift lashings and a hose. Can we make that on us? Rowdy! No, it needs to go. Okay, let me get go back to the base and I'll meet you back. And welcome back. So it's a new day in real life because I got home yesterday. Uh, we have just enough fuel, I guess, to get around a little bit. So if we upgrade, upgrade the buggy with a protected container to burn generic fuel items, routing heat generated to the engine, replacing the need for hydrogen as a fuel. Okay, so we need one hose and two makeshift lashings. Let's see if we can't get that done. Craft item. Oh, I need a broken hose. What about in here? Can I use... Okay, that works too, and I'll be right back. And welcome back. Let's see how far we get before it rings again. <laughs> okay, let's repair our stuff up. We have a little bit of gas in there. I haven't got hydrogen. Uh, we haven't found hydrogen yet, at least. Okay, so to upgrade this, I just need one more leather. Uh, craft le leather. Let's take that. Although, if we upgrade this and then we take it down for our main base, do we lose the stuff that we upgraded it with? I'm not actually sure. Let's go ahead and do... I need a scrap metal chest. Put you right over here where it's a little safer in front of these rocks. I wish I could, like, really line it up. Because we need to go out into the world, but I don't want to go out with a full inventory. Let's go ahead and break some of this stuff down, too. Oh, let's see. Recycle object. What does this give us? Random reward. Alien fibers. Okay. I'm down for that. Um, blue palms taken from an indigenous plant that are used as an ingredient to craft many different items. Okay. There's in a firm. Scalopod shell. Let's grab that. Some food. Craft island. I think that is it. Wait, did I make... Wait, when did I make a regular chisel? Powerful blunt tool. Hardness of seven, and that's a hardness of three. So can I recycle this? Sure can. I don't remember making a regular chisel, do y'all? I know I made a makeshift chisel. Maybe we found it somewhere and I just don't recall. Keycard tier one. Grab antenna. Just kind of taking inventory oh and nighttime is upon us we're gonna have to sleep i'm not going out at night okay so let's go ahead and put up scrap hinges wire rubber broken circuits pumps we're gonna be grabbing more ore while we're out so there's really no point in putting that up right now uh, broken hoses alien hide leather 
I'll put all that up. Is there a sort here? Default. There we go. Oh, my hair buggies. Yeah, we're going to be picking up more of all this, so. But I mean, we're already getting pretty heavy. Do we have anything? 42 rocks, but I need those for when we go to our main base to build our... Our, um... Oh, words are hard. Our defenses. Inflatable dome kit. Kit used to build inflatable dome. To build, right-click on inventory and item. Select build or select the inflatable dome from the structures tab in your character menu. Hmm. Maybe that's something we can sleep out in the world with at night. Okay, let's cook up this food real quick. And then we'll sleep through the night. Perfect. Uh, not there. Sleep for six hours. Yes, please. Actually, we probably should call that an episode because I'm pretty sure we are over time before we head back out. So, Osiris, New Dawn, y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. I'm hoping to do a full-time series on this, but I need y'all to let me know if you want that or not. And hopefully I can find time to record it. So, it might be three to five days a week instead of seven, just because, like I said, I'm working. Um, I woke up too early, I know. I was talking and not paying attention. Where is this bug? I hear you. I don't see you, but I hear you. Definitely sounds like it's coming from that way. I always want to pick up the rocks. Also, I saw something over here. Oh, that was a crab shedding. And a broken barrel. Where is this dude? Is he like under the world, maybe? That's good. Oh, there he is. I see ya. Trying to take out my oxygen tanks. Rude. Boy, they really do go flying when you kill them, don't they? As always, before I go, remember when gaming, have fun, play hard, but in real life, be the change you wish to see in the world. Later, y'all. So.